Welcome back to Nerd Safari. We are still Simon and Ellie. Still? Well, if you enjoy our videos still, then please remember to like, comment, subscribe, and of course hit the bell thing. That would be very kind of you. And you know, we checked out a Sidhu Musawala song recently called Game, where he was with Shooter, a really, really cool song. Then we checked out a Diljit Dosanjh song, which you can see up there, called G-O-A-T, Greatest of All Time, which we really liked. And a few of you jumped on our case saying, Man, you checked out the wrong song. You shouldn't check out Diljeet Dosanjh's version of GOAT. You should check out Sidhu Musawala's version of GOAT. So of course that's what we're going to do. We try to keep you guys happy as best we can. The majority of you. Some of you will never be happy with our choices, but that's just life and YouTube, I guess. Anyway, this song just came out a month ago. It's been really popular. It's had 26 million views in just four weeks. And as usual, we've done our homework on the lyrics of this song because, you know, his lyrics come fast and furious and they can be a little bit difficult to follow. There's lots of stuff in this song around things like, I roam around in cars that I bought myself with honest money. And there's lots of kind of focusing on, like, I made my own way in life, I earned my money and I did it through honest means. But the haters are jealous and they call me a fraud. And again, there's lots of mentions of people saying that his income is fraudulent and assuming things about him that are not true, which, you know, I guess in the rap game, that's probably, unfortunately, pretty common. Uh, he also goes on to say, the police call me a thief, and this is the chorus, the police call me a thief, but the local boys consider me the goat, the greatest of all time. <laughs> which I really like. I mean, who cares what the police think about you? Maybe there's actually something cool about having the police assume that you're a thief. But if the local kids are saying that you're the greatest of all time, come on, that's pretty cool. He also goes on to say things like, a group of murderers roam along with me, we're diamonds at heart, but our work is illegal. So definitely kind of painting the picture that he's walking the, a thin line between what he can get away with and what is illegal. And my favorite bit in the lyrics, he says, he roams around in a Mustang. He keeps his friends close, but his enemies closer. I'm a huge Mustang fan, as you would have seen in the Diljeet Dosanjh Do You Know video, if you saw that. He also finally wraps up the song by saying, people talk a lot, but we don't care. Don't compare us to any goons. So again, trying to show that I'm not a criminal. I made my money through honest means. Assume what you want about me, but it's not true. I'm, I'm a good guy at heart. A diamond at heart. Diamond geezer, as we would say in London. Well, we're going to go ahead right now and check out this video. I'm actually super excited to see this one. And if you want to see what we think about it, then stick around until the end if you like. But for now, let's go. Let's go, goats. Wow. Wow. So the Aye. Ni me hak di kabai vich gehde karda, gehde karda, gehde karda. Ni me hak di kabai vich gehde karda. Sare maj de shri gade proud man de. Tere shahar di police mainu TV aak di ni tere hot de ne mutte mainu hot man de. Shahar di police mainu TV aak di ni tere hot de ne mutte mainu hot man de. Ma 
understand. How karta sa tiger vich yaar gele niya, yara naal rakha meri yaar une de niya. Jede jede si ga sala tauna chak de yaar be khlas na te anti yaar de be de niya. Oh ho rakha de kuch na de de rom de mithi de gele yaar de challenge no si chaud man de. are in the hood Sidhu Musawala with goat what did you think of it it was so fun it was such um kind of classic hip-hop style yes you could really like see his inspiration for it and it was just really fun just seeing him hit all those beats yeah you know there was a lot of it that really reminded me of like classic gangster rap that I used to love and blast so loud in my car I still do but uh like Snoop Doggy Dog the the beats behind it really reminded me of Dr. Dre they had that kind of really heavy slow beats but then this like hip-hop key keyboard style stuff like house piano stuff over the top which just works so well and it's funny like in the game music video that we saw him do with Shooter uh, the, the lyrics were really really fast and rapid and told a really strong story through that felt a lot more methodical and slow this one like he's taking his time with it and if you're the greatest of all time you can take your time I guess yeah, what cool visuals as well. What I liked was they had these super glamorous, like the skyline, I guess that was Dubai with the Burj Khalifa all lit up. Amazing, kind of rich, affluent city. And yet he's on this kind of tanker looking boat. And then like he's in this kind of underground thing, like under a road and just really, the whole music video to me actually kind of told the story of, I guess, like I said earlier, like. I, you may think I'm a criminal, you may think I'm fraudulent, but it kind of showed the difference between a successful musician and actual criminals. Like there were thugs around and like people covering their faces. Um, but you know, I, I liked it that he kind of differentiated, like I'm not a criminal. I drive nice cars and I'm successful and I sold a lot of rap videos. So yeah, yeah, really cool. The bit with cars doing donuts around him really reminded me. I'm a huge fan of the Jim Carner series on YouTube of the people who just do these crazy donuts and stunts and things. And they're normally filmed like that in slow mo using a drone or a hundred different GoPros. And that had just a really cool style like that. So, yeah, to me, it almost felt like a reimagining of a classic rap hip hop style song. Really, really cool. I, the other thing that I picked up on the lyrics that I didn't say earlier is he's got so much pride of being a Jat, which is, I, I believe, and correct me if I'm wrong, it's a group of people in Punjab who uh, come from a Sikh background. And what I really liked was, and there's a lot in the lyrics about, you know, we won't be beaten down, we're proud Jats and things. And I really loved his kind of pride in where he's come from. In the music video, I loved it that there were loads of Sikhs but lots of them were wearing Kesari turbans, like saffron turbans, which, you know, I guess kind of speaks with where they've come from, but also their, their heritage in India as well. I, I, you know, I love little touches like that that just kind of speak to the culture. Well, hey, thank you so much to everyone who recommended that we check out Goat. We've seen two goats now. You know, if I had to pick, though, between Diljit Dosanjh's goat and Sidhu Musawala's goat, I don't know. If, can you have two goats? Yeah. The greatestest of all time? Yeah. I, I hope so. Um, I'd, I, yeah, I wouldn't want to pick. No. 
be scared if they found out. Yeah, you know, both incredibly successful musicians, both with incredibly different styles and messages and just incredibly different people. And surely that's what life should be about, is meeting incredibly different people and appreciating as many as you can. So we, we got a lot of love for all of the goats out there. <laughs> well, unfortunately, though, that is all we got time for today. However... We try to do this. Every day. Every day. We try, but we're probably not managing it at the moment because we're on vacation and dripping these out whenever we get the time to scramble and get one in. But we will see you as soon as we possibly can, friends, on the next Nerd Safari. Peace out, nerds. <laughs>